it's Danny J. So you know part of being a sweaty buddy, I want to motivate, educate, inspire, don't be a bitch. So today we're going to do a little educating. So I got a question about Sensa. And there's a lot of products on the market now that are like these sprinkle products and you take them and you're supposed to just sprinkle them on your food and you magically lose weight. Sounds pretty awesome, right? Okay, so the question was, what are they and how do, and do they work? Let's kind of dig into it. What these products are, I looked up Sensa and we'll go into that one in a minute, but basically what these products are is they're different fibers and the fibers absorb water and they're supposed to expand in your stomach to make you feel full. So I brought a couple fibers here. Basically I've got two psyllium fibers. This is called colonics. Obviously it's supposed to help with your colon. This is actually just a psyllium powder. I'm gonna put some right in here. And then I have, of course, Metamucil. You guys may have heard of this one. And I'm not sponsored by any of these companies or anything like that, it's just something I have. Metamucil is also a psyllium, although this one has just got a little different, it's ground up finer than the other psyllium. So I'm gonna put this in a cup here. And then I found this product in the cabinet. It's called Slim for fat loss and energy. Um, this, the ingredients are biosphere fiber, guar gum, locust bean gum, oat fiber, maltodextrin. So basically these are different guar gums, which are, you know, fibers that expand. So I'm gonna do a little bit of this, Ugh, right in there, okay. And I'm gonna add a little bit of water to these just so you can see what happens when they absorb water and how they get, uh, how they thicken up. So we're gonna leave there and just, we're gonna leave these for just a few minutes. Okay, so the ingredients in Sensa, there's three of them off of the website and they claim you could lose like 30 pounds in 30 days just from sprinkling this stuff on your food. All right, so let's break it down. The first ingredient is maltodextrin. It comes from corn. It's basically a starch derivative, that's a powder, and it's added to a lot of food to make them smoother or just give them a little better taste. It's actually a quick digesting carbohydrate, so it's not really great for you. It's just mostly to make the product smooth and a little bit more palatable. The second ingredient is silica. What silica is, it's actually what's in these little packets when you have your vitamins and they say do not eat. So I'm gonna open up this packet of silica and put it in, um, in this cup. Ooh, I might have to, I have to cut this. Oh, here's scissors. Okay, so I'm gonna open this packet of silica. Now what the silica is, is that there's these little beads, and you may have seen these before, but they have a high affinity for water. So of course these um, products like Sensa tell you to drink a lot of water with, your, with the product. So I'm gonna add a little bit of water into this cup with the silica beads. And, ooh, I hear them popping. Actually, a lot of these silica beads, they, they um, expand with the water so much they actually explode. And then the third ingredient in Sensa is tricalcium phosphate, which is actually an anti-caking ingredient to keep the silica from sticking, basically. And tricalcium phosphate is also used as a raw ingredient to make fertilizer. So I don't know if you really want to be putting that in your body. Okay, so now let's check on our fibers here. All right, so I have, this is the first psyllium powder. I put a little bit of water. Oh, just want to dump it. If you can see, it's like stuck in that glass. This has become a thick, gelatinous goo, okay? So if you have uh, diet pills that are made of, of uh, psyllium, this is basically what's happening. It's turning into this thick goo. Here's the Metamucil. It's a little bit better, but you can see also it's turned into just a thick gel. Just a gel-like substance. And let's try the, the third product, which was the Guar Gum. This is not psyllium like these two. The Guar Gum, same kind of thing. If you can see, the top is just turned into like this a thick, almost pudding-like substance. And they actually use guar gum to thicken sauces, gravies, and that kind of thing. And my silica beads, I know this one's hard to tell. These are really small and it was a small packet, but they've all kind of exploded and they're a little bit bigger. So do these products work? Well, I suppose if I drank this right now, this glob of goo, 
it would sit in my stomach. Theoretically, it says to drink with 12 to 14 ounces of water. So I add more water to this. So it's expanding even more and that's supposed to make you feel full. So I suppose if you're trying to lose weight and you do this before a meal, in theory, you're supposed to eat less. Therefore, you're going to lose weight. That's the idea. Does it have any properties that actually burn fat or speed up your metabolism? No, it doesn't do anything like that. In fact, it might make you start pooping more and then maybe you'll lose more weight that way. I don't know. So these are the main ingredients. Just take a look when you're buying these kind of pills. And I don't know what you would pay for something like Sensa, which I actually think psyllium is a lot safer than the silica, the fertilizer and uh, silicone beads to swallow. I, I would say it's a lot safer to do psyllium. You can always buy some Metamucil and uh, colonics at the store. Take this before your meal, fill yourself up, and then eat less. It's an idea, although I'd say stick with fibers from vegetables, from fruits, watch your portion sizes, and you don't need to worry about any gimmicky pills. So that's all. If you guys have any more questions, leave your comments below. I just wanted to show you kind of this experiment and see what actually happens and what's in these things. And thanks for watching.